right. Can't choke on the weed when you on mushrooms. <laughs> Fuck <Right>. it. <laughs> Can't feel the weed either, so it ain't no point. <laughs> try to use nope. it hard as hell try to get nope. high. Nope. <laughs> nope. Fuck, we ready? I'm ready. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode. One more of them. We done did 103 of them. Now, this is 104 of them. Four of them. You know what happened Four. after 104 months? That's two motherfucking years. Two of them. That's a motherfucking birthday. It's a birthday, That's bitches. Shit, I said 104 Happy months. Happy birthday to us. Okay, then. Happy birthday. Not the Steven version. To All right. Us. Happy birthday. Up, oh, time boy. Let me oh, get it back. Some uh, smoke bitch. some bitch. We in this hoe. Oh. 256 788 7339. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Uh uh, nope. No, you're going to give me this time. I did say 104 months. It's not weeks, 104 weeks. months. I was going to let it go. <laughs> Whatever they don't know. We all just, I think they know. They sh- <laughs> I hope they know. Look, if you've been with it us is, the whole years. time, now you might notice a little something. Well, you ain't had to been with us the whole time to know this yeah. is different. If you've been with us recently, then you might wonder what happened. What the f- If you've been with us the whole time, then you know. You we done moved back to what we was and we taking it to the future. This our back to the future set. Fuck it. It could just be the back to the future set. All right. Shit. All right. <laughs> this our back to the this future back set. Back to the future set. We went back to some shit we going to the future with. We in the future. We could- we is in the it, right now. It's the future all the time. The and present the is the future because the past just happened. Exactly. And then it's the past of what's finna happen in the morning. It's just when you pointed it past, it was in two different places. It was because you know the timeline fucked yeah, up. Yeah. I, they, they I got fucking it. Now. Illuminati the and fucked the timeline up. Hell yeah. Shit, quantum leap. <laughs> <laughs> they don't know what that is. <laughs> 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 if she don't know what quantum leap is, she's too young for you. Listen, welcome back. You know we in this motherfucker. We the smokers. I got my yeah, partner yeah. with me. My partner Bob Jacquez in this motherfucker. And y'all already know who I'm is. If you don't, I'm finna tell you who I'm is. I'm is the oh, Reverend Kato Jackson. I hold your applause to the end. You already know what it is. We finna do some things. We finna smoke some shit. We finna talk some shit. Smoke we finna some drink bitch. some shit, cause that's what we do on the Smoke Mid Podcast. We'll preach at y'all fucking with it one more time. We do. Um she comment, did. like, subscribe. Do all this shit. Share. Look, it's a bell uh, on it, YouTube. You don't even have to like all click you gotta do is click. Click Just on the bell. It on it's phone. gonna turn blue. Click it on your on your and Every time we post some shit, your phone gonna be like, dang, these nigga posted some shit. Right. Watch this. Watch some more. We got other shit. Speaking of this set, you know what I'm saying? The drink of the week, which yeah, will be coming right. back in the future of the past. With another you set. Know. Um, go check out them videos, man, and make you some drinks because we, we did them all. We had more sets than L.A., nigga. Oh. <laughs> Calm down. Calm down. Fit the ass sets all over this bitch, man. All right. We fit the ass sets all over this bitch. What else we got? We had to... Um, we went through at least most of the alphabet. We did the, just fizzle a lot with that motherfucker. <laughs> the puppet to put it out. We were having technical difficulties. Man, Things right. weren't going right. That shit, today has been a day. We, itself, and then we, so. damn near, we got like the wilds, X or Y or Yeah, we only shit. had like two or three letters left. Hey, y'all pick your own songs for the last letters. Ain't no man. Ain't no tell us what they out. are. Ain't and and uh, leave a message. Send a text. 256-788-7339. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Google the Smoking Permitted Podcast because we the only one. We the only one. It's the another only one. Kato Jackson in China, but he ain't me. But Smoking Permitted Podcast, it ain't another one of those. It ain't another one. We the only one of those. The only. Um, how was your week? How was my week? I had a good week, shit. Hey, At least a good up. today. I mean, ain't, ain't really nothing happened this week except for just going, oh, all right. I took a little mini vacation from work because they played with me a little bit. Uh-huh. <laughs> I, it's, a, it's a long I'll story. Do. I ain't going to get into it, but yeah, they was like, ain't no work today. It's like, oh, okay. Um, I ain't coming tomorrow. <laughs> I ain't say that till tomorrow. Like, yeah, no, nah, I ain't coming today. <laughs> Dang. Ain't no work today for me neither, guys. Right. Um, yeah, I get to do it too. Ha, ha, okay, look. right. Look how that goes. Look and how that you works. Decide when I work, don't get I shit. Fuck. Ain't this with all these days for anyway, goddamn. Right. Like, it was these vacation days. Um, 
I got a free haircut for some reason. No idea. No idea. But I think I might know. Because if I, I go, hope you know. If I go to the barbershop. I hope you know, Kato. You know what I'm saying? If, if, you... I go, if I go to the barbershop, I, I pay the same thing. Whether I get like a whole haircut or just like an edge up or whatever, I pay the same thing every time. And I'm, I feel, because every time I do it, like when I get an edge, it's like, oh, this is a little much. Like, nah, I'm like, fuck. Yeah, like this, yeah. Because. What I pay for either one of those ain't what most motherfuckers pay for a haircut. So I would show my gratitude and shit. Like, I know I could be doing more. Like, I'm, anybody else, I'll be paying more than this anywhere right. for real. So, yeah, fuck this shit. Same thing every time. And this time I pulled it out, it was like, yeah, nah, the money. Um, <laughs> He was like, nah. I was like, what you mean? Nah, he was like, nah, I appreciate the love and shit. Nah, you just, like, nah, you got to take the money, God damn it. Like, this ain't how this shit's supposed to go for real. <laughs> He was like, nah, nah, fuck this. I was like, yeah, oh, shit, bet y'all did. I don't argue with your shit. I can keep it to it. Man. Um, okay. And then, after that, I made my acting, my, my actorial debut today, so she <laughs> motherfucker put me in the movie. So, yeah, I, I feel like I had a, and I All feel right. like, yeah. Dang, my week was playing, Jane, and this happened on the weekend. I feel like that made a good week, shit. Okay. Hey. They did. They wrapped it up nice. That's hey. what's up. That's what's up. So y'all look for, I can't tell you the name of the movie or, or none of that shit, but I'm going to tell you when the time, and y'all going right. to see me. And you, like, look you at that nigga right there, there goddamn it, shit. I know my first from movie. the podcast. It's only my first one. Many more to come. See, Chevron Shout is like he going to put us in the movie, goddamn Oh, that's right. That's We're going right. to see. We're going to see. We're going to see. What about your week, man? How your week been? Uh... It was a regular week. It was a regular week. I worked. Um, I had a horrible, horrible Thursday. That's fucked Jesus. up. Jesus. I was. Damn, was, Thursday? Yeah, Thursday was not my friend this week. But, uh, um, yeah, no, nah, regular week. Got the kids back. You know what I'm saying? When it took them to the, uh, I found a, I found another little lake somewhere in Madison. Up on It's like 20 minutes from my house. I saw the pictures. Yeah. Um, I took them up I there. I know. Is that, what's the name? It wasn't Green Mountain, was it? No. No. I don't think so. I, that's the only place I've seen a covered bridge like that was Green Mountain. Maybe it is. But I it, don't it, remember. I had to put it back in my... my Green Mountain ain't in Madison, uh, though, so maybe it wasn't. Okay. But yeah, yeah, it's, you got to go off Weatherly on the south side and just ride up through the neighborhood for a little that's while. That's Green Mountain. Okay. Well, I was at Green Mountain. Yeah. That's not Madison? It says Madison on the GPS. Madison is the other. I just said with the GPS. <laughs> yeah, okay. A little white lady tell me where I'm at. Right, yeah, she lied to <laughs> hey, Look, she do be lying sometimes. Yeah, I'm fine with it. Okay. You got to know yourself and your couple. You know yeah, what I'm saying? My relationship with her. South Huntsville. Yeah, so uh, hey, Green I took Mountain. them up there. I did we some photo around. shoots up there. Yeah, I saw some folks taking pictures, waiting out there and shit. But uh, yeah, went out there, uh, walked around for a bit and shit. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, no, no, nothing, nothing except me thinking that a deer was gonna jump on top of my car. It didn't, though. Did. Order. It didn't. Okay, thank God. Right. But it, it made me think it was, and I didn't know what to do. I was a little scared. Oh, shit. I hadn't really been that frightened in a long time. But it was just for a split second. A deer, a deer trick you, man. A deer it, it do some shit. It's, it's worse than a squirrel. I hate when them squirrels be doing that dumb shit. Man, you, you just know you finna hit this bitch, guy. <laughs> I know you. No, 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 I ain't hit the bitch. <laughs> I, I guess if I made the sad, I hit the bitch. Hit it. Man. All right, all right, doo doo. Yeah, I didn't hit some of them. I didn't hit some of them. Oh, but man. they be dumb as hell. Dumb as hell. <laughs> motherfucker, do this shit a couple times and run towards the motherfucker. You you was deciding on which way to go and you still pick this life way. Life or death. Life or death. Death. <laughs> Fuck like, damn. Wait, right. wait. Under the car now. I've only maybe hit like two in my whole life. I think that, that might be about what I done. I ain't hit many. I'm gonna tell you, I done rode over so many animals. Like, when not hit them, but they under the yeah. car with like. I know, because I just had to explain that to my son that that's who was going up the mountain. There was two dead possums in the road. Way too many. And one of them was right in the middle of the road, and I moved over so it would go under the car, you know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't roll over. And I'm talking about live ones, though. Oh, shit. Like, yeah, like you finna hit this bitch, but you, like, this close to. No. Oh, yeah, nah, well, yeah, squirrels. I do this shit with a lot of shit, like red out here. It'd be rabbits and raccoons and possums Damn. and a cat sometimes. <laughs> I did see something that I couldn't tell if it was a cat or a fox. 
Yeah, nah, I, don't, I, I don't know what the fuck that was. It was big enough to be a fox, but it didn't. I ain't see the black on the tail. Shit, I, I wasn't sure. Big ass, strong ass big cat. Ass. Hey, them animals out in that country. I forgot about the house that got the dog pack. Know somebody else? Big ass, strong ass cat. <laughs> I don't even. I don't like where this is going. I don't. Like, I don't. Dwight. Damn. Damn, damn. Bust them damn. books out open. That's his name now? The white bust them books out open. Bust that bussy open. Oh, Who got some shit. Bussy? Who got some bussy? I, I don't know the man's name, but apparently, someone is accusing the former NBA. Now, we ain't playing now. I don't know if he's playing now. He was in Taiwan. He, I think he still play. I think he's in the States, though. I don't oh, know if he's might, like, I don't know what he's doing. He no, he's out. trying to get on the Lakers. Was he? Yeah. Yeah, he's still, I don't know. But either way, former NBA star Dwight Howard has been accused of taking some bussy. <laughs> he made a statement. He said, I didn't take it. He gave me the pussy. Is that what he said? He pretty much. He said it was consensual. Yeah. He said whatever happened was consensual. Yeah. That means he gave him the pussy. <laughs> he might have just got some head. He might have, but I don't think so. He might have just got some head. Is there another name for head from a man like pussy? I don't know. Man I don't head. know. Man, you got some head. Go. Man head. <laughs> man head. Fuck it. <laughs> I guess I don't know. We we can't call on them terms. We can't be the ones that decide that. We, I was just wondering, like, so you heard someone say? No, nah, like, I wasn't no, trying no, I to come it. up with. Man, one. okay. Like, I thought like maybe you heard it. Did it sound like, it. like is that what they say? I haven't. I had not heard where. Because I'm sure I heard a bus. I'm sure it's what. I'm sure it's what. That's wild. To put boy and pussy together. Pussy. That's wild. Why would as you hell. put boy with pussy? Because I don't know. Yeah. Humans are crazy, yo. People crazy as hell. People oh, crazy as hell. They do what they want to do. Fuck it. Yeah. I mean, I guess unless it wasn't consensual. I don't think. I don't know. I can't say that. I was, but I'm just I saying. I was it was consensual. That's um, a big ass dude, man. It's a large. He's strong large as man. fuck. He could take some pussy if he wanted. <laughs> <laughs> and he was charged with like kidnapping, some type of version of kidnapping. Or oh, he been charged. I mean. Uh, Whatever they, whatever the dude said, accused. I said. Okay, I I know, like, I guess. Who was? Prison charges got to come sooner or later, yeah. I saw him on an interview with uh, that, the dude's first question was, um, are you gay? Who, the dude? Yeah, he asked Dwight if he was gay. Oh, uh, oh. Uh, what'd he say? He said, uh, that's my personal business, basically. I guess it is. Like, whatever my, Whatever I do. Is, got shit to do with basketball. Shit, yeah. got to do with you. I guess not. Especially if it's a basketball interview, goddamn it. I don't think it was a basketball interview. It was oh, like okay. on a podcast. Like a personal, yeah. But but damn, Dwight. I, I saw because when he was doing them videos from Taiwan, them shits was funny to me. Oh, yeah. When he was he he had a video, he would tell LeBron, he was like, Bro, come over here. No. You know you want to be the coach. You tell everybody what to do, you can do that over here. You can definitely come on, do they pay him a lot of money, Bron. Come on. But he had he was like, before you even got to Bron, he would tell the other folks. Yeah. He just jump on Instagram live from Taiwan and just start talking shit. And them videos was funny to me. I just seen some sideline videos of Dwight <laughs> Howard in the NBA doing some shit. Well, you would think, like, yeah, like he's. I've seen him touch some men inappropri- inappropriately on the sideline of the NBA games. See, <laughs> I get that, and obviously that would that would be a large factor in this conversation. But also, all these athletes, it's a lot of athletes that I I don't know. Yeah, that was one of my yeah. biggest things about sports. Like, I don't I don't want to be nowhere where everybody just want to slap each other on the ass. You're right. Shit. We're not taking showers together or none no. of this shit. You're and right then you about keep that. spitting where I'm supposed to line up. It, yeah, that's some bullshit too. Yeah, like it's a lot of this don't that spit I don't on the field. Yeah, I don't. don't spit, motherfuckers spit on the basketball court. Really? Yes. Like on the wooden basketball yes, court. Yes, nigga. Yes. What? Yes. The fuck? Yes. I ain't never seen that. I ain't Somebody comment. Tell me I ain't lying. I ain't, Somebody I, I didn't play some ball, but I 
I would be appalled. I'm talking about, and then rub that shoe and make the skirt, skirt. Oh, okay, then. Do that with the, nigga, yeah, this yeah, fit up. Like, this ain't the ground. It's the flow, nigga. Yeah, and they spit <laughs> right on that bitch. That's, hey, did I just, I ain't really know. I was, I was taking it back. How you do, how you be? <gasps> Graham. <laughs> <laughs> Graham my pearls, God <laughs> This nigga spit on the flow. Where the fuck For are real, you like from, that. nigga? Who the fuck raised you? He's, yeah. Uh, I don't know how we got to. Who the fuck raised spit. you niggas? Um, but yeah, the White House accused the rape shit. He, so he said guess, he didn't do it. He said you know. it was consensual. And this, a lot of this shit go on with athletes and sexual partners. Yeah. And I don't think that he necessarily would have to all of a sudden do this to somebody you wouldn't think after so. all this time. Well, you, I mean, you wouldn't think so for real. But. But it's always I'm, anybody doing this shit to somebody, I can't understand it. A rich motherfucker doing this shit to somebody, I can't understand it even mm-hmm. more for right. real. Right. But then I guess it could be like a, a power thing for real, for real. It could not have nothing to do with like the sexual gratification come from taking it for real. Like you want a motherfucker to not want it for real. That's the only thing that, that could make sense as to why a motherfucker would do this. I just this. feel like you could pay someone to do that. You're you right. But you know they're pretending for real and they're doing it for some money. But if they do it good enough, then why does it matter? It don't matter for real. You, I, I agree. Go get you a hook and act scared. <laughs> <laughs> Which is weird. I would say that. I agree. But sometimes I, I, th- I hear about shit like this and I try to understand like what would make you. Yeah, no. Like, what what would make to... you decide? Yeah, no. I'm gonna sit in these bushes, and the next bitch that run by, fuck these. I'm gonna jump out and, and fuck the bitch. Like what? <laughs> That's how it is work. I don't know if they just be like the next bitch. All right, let's get off. <laughs> <Okay. of this. laughs> so you don't say this. It'll be in the motherfucker in the bushes in Central Park. I don't think he's like just the down. next bitch. I think he's more picky than just, that. I mean, uh, she she jogging, so you got to be like an athletic bitch or something. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's, it's, Pick more pick. Like he just, just watching pick. bitches run by. Yeah. <laughs> Someone went on by. Take a one. <laughs> oh, I see one coming. I like Man, this. One. What? I like, I like this, this one. Oh, don't turn, don't turn, don't turn. Step don't on turn, a don't. twig and break it. <laughs> Motherfucker look up for one the other way. <laughs> okay, no, this is horrible. So we're done. We're done with She it. got away though. No, she, we're not. she got away. Uh, dude, what's next? <laughs> <laughs> he stepped on the twig. She escaped. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit. Jesus. Oh, um, I guess talk about Sierra and mm. Russell. Well, Miss, I I feel like get away. Should we go with the the list before we get into that? Let's get to the list first, then I guess because that would be the natural. Well, not even that, just because yeah. Well, I mean, I need, also that. I need my phone for the list. Oh, okay. Equip thyself. Where your tablet at? It's somewhere, goddamn. I don't even know no more. Dang. I be losing shit when well, nah, I ain't lost. It's That's another big wrong. ass iPad. Yeah, it's, a, it's another wrong. Oh shit, they trying to book us for a show. Oh. Who wants to be on their podcast? I thought we was going to sing Happy Birthday or something. No, no, no. It's karaoke or something. Um, so it's been a few lists going around. You know, around here, we fuck with some lists. I don't know how the fuck we got so involved in lists, but when they come out, we're going to bring it to you. We're going to bring them to you. This list. Y'all remember the Waffle House? No, not the Waffle House. The the fucking Cheesecake Factory. Yeah. She treated it like the Waffle House. I think. She did. <laughs> I could see if you was mad like that on the first date at the Waffle House. Man, okay, all right. Yeah. All right. Got Unless you have told me up. you like the Waffle House. Right. <laughs> then, then, all right. But, yeah, that Cheesecake Factory shit was wild. So, and I still don't know if it was staged or not, but it doesn't matter. Of course. The internet. Like, 97.9% of all the videos on the internet are absolutely staged. The like, them people probably been thing. together for fucking nine years. <laughs> <for real. laughs> like, nah, we just gonna pull up and act like you. Yeah. No. <laughs> I just don't know how they would get it off if no one's ever seen them. Like, it would, I mean, they have to never be seen to get it off, is what I mean. What you mean? Because if there are people that people know and they're already online doing shit like this, then people gonna know, like, oh, that's them and it's gonna... Everyone gonna say, "Oh no, that's them. This was staged." Oh, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Like you have so. to have the perfect staging thing 
for your first coming out. So yeah, maybe that can, ain't and, them. And it's got to be a one and done. They just got two people. Like yeah, nah, let's let's got damn collab on this video. Say so we yeah, act like yeah. Maybe. So my yeah, they, I be I be wondering that every time this shit happens, and I be in my mind trying to figure out how the fuck. If it if it stays, like how did we get to this point of staging this? And what did you do before and after this? Like what do you do now in life? Man, what did what? you do before? I I've seen her. She's been on a few interviews and podcasts since this shit happened. Mm. So she making her rounds, goddamn. So maybe it wasn't staged. Maybe maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was real. I th- I think it might have been real for even though most of the videos on the internet fake as fuck. Yeah. I guess this could have been real for real. But it could have been staged too, guys. Could have been staged. Definitely could have been staged. Yeah. So either, but it 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 brought up some points. It did. That a lot of motherfuckers had, and the females decided we're gonna make a list of places you should never take a first date. Men should never take women. And this motherfucker got twenty eight things on this bitch. Oh, uh, we're not doing all twenty. That's a lot of shit. We're of course, doing. number one apparently now, the fucking cheesecake factory is off limits. First date. Have you now. eaten there? I'd fucking fuck with the Cheesecake For Factory. Real? Absolutely. I haven't eaten there. If I, don't I think maybe I did once. Maybe. I feel like Cheesecake Factory is second date material anyway. For real. Oh. I'm just saying. Oh. I'm just saying. Oh. Yeah. Let me find it. I'm just saying. This yeah, it ain't. Yeah. So you know when you look on the on when you looking for places to eat, they got <coughs> the little dollar signs to show you like if it got four dollar signs, mm-hmm. this shit high as hell. Yeah. If it got two dollar signs, it's pretty much most people. Cheesecake Factory might got three for real. Okay. I don't even know Wait, if I fucking if like that's you. That's second date. What's first date? Two. Two dollar signs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's, I don't even fucking know if I like this bitch yet. So what are the two dollar sign places? What's a two dollar sign place? <laughs> TGI Fridays is a two dollar sign place. So Fridays is worse than Cheesecake Factory? Cheesecake Factory costs a little more than Fridays. Cheesecake Factory. I think I'd rather go to. Well, I, I haven't really been to Cheesecake. But I think cheesecake, I'd rather go to it's, Friday. It's not like up. It's for Cheesecake Factory, PF Chains. I don't. And I, they, them like them the same hmm. level restaurant for real. Let's show you what I be doing, Kato. I don't know. I don't know. PF Chains just expensive Chinese food. Yeah. All but right. yeah, two dollars. I don't even. Yeah, I'm finna spend a lot of money. First date, I got for real, for real. I got about a hundred dollars. <laughs> oh, some real shit. Right. I got about a hundred dollars. Both of us ain't gonna eat at fucking um, Cheesecake Factory for a hundred dollars. Leave a tip and then go do something else. <coughs> When's the last time you and someone went and ate somewhere for a hundred dollars? And where was it at? Shit, I, I, like most Saturdays, me and my old lady go out somewhere and eat. We try somewhere new every time, and the shit. Most of the time, it end up being between sixty and ninety, a hundred dollars, somewhere between them, depending on if it's two or three dollars size. <laughs> we don't do four like this special. <laughs> okay. Okay. Are there places that have five that are like around here? I think I think from the little right now, I be seeing four is like as high as it gets. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I thought there was a five. All right. That, I mean, no. I guess it, it could. I guess no. I think. Fives, I, I might not Just know nobody about gets them. a five. Yeah, I don't know about nobody them. I don't five. know what a five is. <coughs> All it's, right, so what did what do you had to say? Cheesecake Factory, number one. Number two, Applebee's. Fuck them. Applebee's is made Bitches for first love dates. Applebee's. Applebee's is made Y'all for first dates. They dripping. They dripping for real. <laughs> Let me see. All right, Chili's. Now I'm taking you to Chili's. Got it. Chili's, <laughs> yeah, baby, man, all right. barbecue sauce. They got the movies on here. You can't take a bitch to the movies on your first day no more. I never really like doing that. That's what I'm doing. The first, like we're going to a movie and we're going to dinner. That's what we're doing. Maybe if we're doing both. Yeah, but we rather, gotta do both. Yeah. I rather. Yeah, if we only doing one, we're going to dinner. I rather eat before. Yeah, we'll yeah. eat and then maybe we'll go to the movies. Yeah, yeah. If I like you enough after dinner, yeah, we can go to the movies. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't like just going to sit in the movie with somebody I don't know. Yeah, no, nah, I got to go. I got to yeah, like I you at dinner first to yeah, go. And then the go. movies is to really see where we finna go, where the night yeah. go ahead there. It's dark in here. We sit next to each yeah, other and shit. Yeah. What's, what's about to happen? Yeah, yeah. But I got to. Yeah, they got I, it easy now. They got. Never mind. Keep going. I got to like you 
to go to the movies. <laughs> Your house. Okay. All right. No fast food. That work. I don't really want you to know where I live, bitch. I don't. I don't. No, you, it's got to be a while for real. Like, what would I, <laughs> like we going to get a room somewhere for you know where I live in for real. Yeah. <laughs> a be couple mad times. Show up. A couple what times. Like, we going to get a room yeah. a couple times. You going to yeah. think I got a bitch come to your place? for real. I'll I really don't want to come over there for real. Cause I'll, I don't know who be coming know. over yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> but I'll pop up a little bit. My second. baby dad in the dog in the closet. No, I'm yeah, finna I'm pop not. him. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm finna walk straight out the front door. He say anything tough. Calm down, what what? Let me see what else on here. Red lobster on here. Yeah, y'all tripping. Yeah. What not else? Not the cheddar baby biscuits, <laughs> granddad. <laughs> None of them. No cheddar biscuits. You church? Like no, nah, you can't take a bitch for the first day oh, to get some. Yeah, no, not these. Oh. <laughs> they got church on it. <laughs> church. Why would you do that anyway? I agree with this one. Yeah. Why would you? It's, it's such a silly ass list. Okay, Don't we got to go on because there's, there's two more well, lists, we, ain't it? Ice cream dates, movie nights, um, a bar for drinks, Waffle House. Yeah, they a bullshit. Bar? Can't go to a bar. Can't go have drinks, goddamn So the men. Immediately responded. Hell yeah. Um, I, I, let me see. A list. Well, we absolutely would not be taking bitches on first dates. <laughs> I don't know whatever the fuck Nobu is. Maybe that's one that get five. God, <clears throat> um, Roof Chris. The real famous takeouts rappers talk about. Okay, it. then we got Roof Chris, <laughs> Papa Nose, Carbones, and Mr. Childs. Them the top five. <coughs> so, yeah, I guess them would be the fives. Yeah, they would be all them would be fives. God damn it! Yeah. No, no prime steakhouses. Yeah, no five star restaurant at all. Um, the mall. You said this is where they can't take pictures at? No, well, you, yeah, you, not pictures, bitches. This is where you don't take the. Home. This is where you don't take them. Okay, they doing too much. No, no malls, no designer stores. Okay, you can't take a bitch to the airport. You can't fly. <laughs> you can't fly these bitches out the first time. No more of that shit. His um, hair's doing it. Overseas? Who the fuck is first dating these bitches overseas? Well, <laughs> what? I think you'd be surprised, Kevin. What? I done met this bitch at the gas station. I'm finna take her to Barbados now. <laughs> I'm just saying, I think you'd be surprised. I guess Maybe I would. Maybe not in, in our city. I, it is, <coughs> I couldn't imagine. It, I, man, I'm filthy rich. Bitch, you is not finna get flowed out the country the first time I meet you. Out. Uh-uh. Flow her out. Uh-uh. Like you never know what might happen. Bitch, I will fly you Y'all to Nashville. Y'all might meet three more bitches when you get there, all on the strength fly, of her. Fly you to Nashville. <laughs> she has some hot chick, some we pickled go, chicken. I, I, Nashville Why hot chicken and pickles, Dolly Parton. I like it. Oh, you like pickles? I like pickles, yeah. Wow. Um, No friends' houses. No your house. You can't house. go to your friends' house. You can't use your phone. Don't be on social media. Nope. You did say beauty shop, no beauty shop. None of those. No lashes, nail shops. No. Um, no places where you frequently went with your ex. I don't agree with that. I don't give a fuck who you came here with. If it's a nice place, then I'm here. <laughs> no, I like this place, but you used to come here with your nigga. We can't come I, here no I, more. It could, it could depend. Shit. It, it depend on how she acting. Work functions. You can't take a bitch on your work function. Your first date? Do a work function? Are they saying first date or just period? Where you just can't take bitches? Yeah, a first date. Uh, this is a first date, yeah. Yeah, they, they just, they, it's the internet, man. They just you matching the energy. You gotta be a wife to come to some shit at work, God damn it. I don't know. I'm real close to it. Like, we live together before you come to some shit at work of mine. Ain't no way hell. I don't know. You show up with a bad bitch, might get you the deal sign that you wanted. Mm, fuck that. I don't even know this bitch. <laughs> this bitch is stuck to eat people food in she her pocket. She gone after that. Is it now your, <laughs> yeah, now but they gonna want to see her now. Next meeting, a next uh, next work event with this bitch at. You already signed it. Yeah, deal. but now they asking about okay, your wife and shit. Go find her and have her. No. The female, she like, where's your lady friend? I don't fucking know. Your lady friend. I gave that bitch $300. Right. <laughs> I don't know. And I told her she could return the clothes. Wait, what? I took that bitch to goddamn <laughs> out back before we left. <coughs> Please, what was so, the, what was the next list? So and now it's another so, list. They 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 going back and forth with these lists. This is why this all started from this stupid ass video. This is okay. this list. 
It's just men, women should not date. Just period. Like fuck first dates. Just don't right. go nowhere don't with even these go niggas. On a date with. Um, men with toddlers or younger, number one. Men that live with their mama, number two. Live men that live with their baby mama, number three. I feel like that should be number one, guy baby. No. Men that live with their baby mama is number three. Yeah, I, I could see that. That's baby. you'd rather what was not the first one? The men with toddlers or younger. You'd rather not date a man mom, with a toddler. The third one was baby yeah. Mom. He could live with yeah, his I baby mama as long as he been, got a toddler. Those Absolutely. Absolutely. Cause that's ridiculous. But hey, I ain't hey, I can't tell him how to think. I guess not, but that's ridiculous. You gotta put the twisted sort of the foot up under where the Yeah, it, it, it was hell. But yeah, baby mama, number three, is why I got there. But um down low men, number four. The gable they ain't said nothing. Oh, um, maybe that should be number one. That, I think baby oh, mama should be number one. Down low should be number two. That's a close. It's close. It's close. But there could be, you know, there's some outliers where just because he living there don't mean that there's a permanent thing and nothing happening. It don't so, matter. I don't, I'm. You can't. I think the down low gotta go one. You can't just be running around fucking dudes and she don't know. Man, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess when you put it like that, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Damn, I don't know one. I don't want no dick in my brother. Man, okay. You right. You right. For my son. No, you none of that. None of that. You right. You right. I would have good grief. <laughs> this is this is number one. Oh. Number five is men that don't have valid driver's license. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Okay. Oh, that was me for so long in my life. Couldn't date these bitches. Couldn't I would have had none of them. Men that mouth. bank with cash out. <laughs> I'll be seeing that Cash App thing or the Zelle or, or all the Venmo and shit they be talking about. Um, men who clothes are in tubs. <laughs> are in tubs? I guess oh, like you live in all like storage tubs. I thought of a bathtub. Man, that's what I thought at first. Yeah. I did. We're like, yeah, nah, if that nigga got his clothes in the bathtub, don't date him. <laughs> oh. A lot of this shit is like, of course, like men that disrespect women, um, that's, that's, that should be a given. Yeah. Um, me, truck drivers, I ain't no <laughs> no truck drivers. Truck, me, truck drivers be getting it done though. Me and they live in motels. They, uh, <laughs> if you, you live at the why. room, you can't get there. I go. I go. One of my stops is at a, a motel. Man, it's, okay. They got three different buildings, but I'm, I'm gonna tell you, it's couples up in there. No, man. Shit. In that bitch. In that bitch. Man, all right. One bed. Shit, I, two souls. I, I I pretty much lived out of hotels with a bitch for about three or four months for real. Yeah, just out here wild and just like fuck it, bitch. That's we can live in hotels. Yeah, we gonna be right here. Man, what? We'll just go over there this time. Cause motherfucker, like first couple times, like we ain't got clean up or none of this shit. Like, you, yeah, like we can do this shit for a little while. Yeah, <laughs> just, yeah, yeah, but, folks, I, yeah they in there. Um, temporary service men's men's that don't know the suit. I don't own a suit. Yeah, me either. But you can't no date more. me. Me and the hairline gone, but they keep holding on. I think I'm getting close. I don't know. I mean, bitches do that too, though. So oh, they do we that should the put the life. bitches on the list too. That's Bitch, if your life. hairline leaving and you holding on to nah, it. No, their hairline been gone. You keep pulling this shit so tight, bitch. Yeah. Uh, men without transportation. Stop putting that heavy hair on your edges. And some married men is no... Bruh. Married men is number 27 on this motherfucking list. Ain't nothing wrong with that. 27. Ain't nothing wrong. What was right before that? Um, Men that always talk about what they used to have. <laughs> <laughs> but see, you got it now, so. <laughs> but I had it, though. I had it. If you had seen me, when I had it. Number t- my truck driver is number 18. Married men is nine places below that. Yeah, Most of the truck drivers are married. That's wild, though. I don't know. I'm just saying. F- There's only 29 things on this list, and married men is oh, 27. God. This is the stupid. Thank you, Internet. For, it's almost okay to date a married man. Another wonderfully stupid piece of nonsense. That I think we got another really list. Needs. Stop. No, that's the last list. I was about to say, three list. of them. I remember, like, it's a third <laughs> <Man>. list. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fucking stupid. I didn't read any these of these lists. I never would have read any of these This lists. is the first time this I've read these lists. 
And these bitches wild. Dumb as hell. These bitches. I right. mean, at some of it right. is like you. It's that ha ha, but I'm serious. Ha ha. Yeah. Like, and then you throw some dumb shit in there to make it seem like you you really was playing the whole time, which is just the this internet in a nutshell. Anyway, is the internet like? Man, don't let nobody Never tell mind. you. You like Applebee's and you like taking bitches to Applebee's. Bitch, if you like going to Applebee's on your first day, fuck what the internet said. Go to Applebee's, get you some dollar margaritas, and get you about 20 of them bitches. Yeah. And do what you do. Go yeah, to the I, movies I and get of, close I mean, with I, a truck driver, bitch. I, I don't know. Like, uh, it's, it's so many levels to that shit, too, because... You don't know what the fuck if you just taking somebody on the first date that you ain't really talk to, you don't know what they like like that. Yeah, I'm not I'm not spending no bunch of money on no first date. I don't even know if I like you. That don't make no sense. That don't make no fucking sense. Like bitch, we could go get some coffee and walk around the park. Yeah. <laughs> for we real. Ain't got walk. We could sit down right over there as a bitch. Okay. Somebody may invented these for, for us to real. sit on. Cause yeah, no, you're not finna get all this shit on the first date and Why? you an awful fucking person. Yeah. And I done spent seven hundred dollars to, to find out I don't even fuck with you for real. I'm she all right. Mm. She mm, I don't say this maybe. shit. We finna talk some shit. That was part of. That was part of. At the first, what I yeah. I don't say know where I'm shit. at with this right now, but let's let's get to Sierra. Maybe oh, I'll, maybe I'll say it after that. Sierra and Russell Wilson. So it's her birthday, and she had mentioned to Russell Wilson she liked the Waffle House. Word. So for her birthday. He decided I'm gonna rent out the entire Waffle House. I hate when they do shit like that. Why they put entire? Entire, <laughs> the whole thing. Like it ain't one room anyway. The, the whole, all of the kitchen, the back, the break room is mine. Bitch, don't use the bathroom in here. Oh, but you, it's still <coughs> one room. It's all one room. Stop. The, you can't say entire Waffle lot. House. Don't come I ain't never seen the Waffle lot. House that you could call entire. Man, what upstairs too? <laughs> <laughs> Nah, bitch, don't even go upstairs. The rope pe- at the stairs. The rope at the you stairs. You got to let me see your wrist? No wrist, man, no wrist. Oh, okay, never mind. You don't play for the right. Seahawks, do you, bitch? <laughs> the entire Waffle the House. The entire Waffle House. The whole I, I, thing. I get it, though. I don't, don't want to sound like I'm hating. I just hate that head. Like I hate the use of the word like that. This, I think this is some out-of-the-way hood shit. That's, I think it's fire. I, I, fuck that. Rent out some nice shit. <laughs> no. Hey, fucking Waffle House. No. Hey, no Waffle House. If, bitch, don't rent me no Waffle House. <laughs> you don't want Waffle House. I, I, I like Waffle House. I stop yeah, at Waffle not, House sometimes. Yeah, but that's not what you want. Bitch, don't rent me no Waffle House. Well, and he didn't rent it. He rented that bitch for a day. <laughs> he rented it. Bitch. I said rent it 12 times. It's too late. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the whole day. They only need to be in there for about an hour and a half. Rent that bitch the whole day. Yeah, so they can do it whenever they want. We woke, we woke up at 7 o'clock. We're going to spend the day in Waffle House. <laughs> Fuck it. Let's go change this, it to the bathroom. We're going to come today. out in 10 minutes. We're going to shop and bring our bags back to Waffle House. <laughs> <laughs> this is where we had today. <laughs> Fuck that. I got the whole day. God damn it. Man. The hot box is in the bathroom. Shit. I don't know. I wouldn't. It's not some shit I would do. I wouldn't want to go. I'm not gonna rent a bitch to Waffle House. No. I don't. I mean, I don't see what's wrong with. It. I Ain't nothing wrong with it I though. She like Waffle House. She like Waffle House. And she like the way they ingredients taste. I, I bet she likes some more than Waffle House though. And, and and she oh she just had another baby. She pregnant. She now. pregnant. Hell. Okay. Come on. She likes some more than Waffle House. Yeah, but she wants some Waffle House. I guess so though. She hey. pregnant. It's, it's it's amazing just to be able to do that shit for right. <laughs> Just yeah, now nah, we finna come up there tell everybody to leave. <laughs> yeah. How much it, y'all did? I Man, know y'all was just mad about how much y'all was making. Y'all was hey. trying to go on strike or some shit, right? How much How'd did that you work make out? tonight? You didn't make it. Didn't work. Just give everybody a thousand dollars. Didn't we? This bitch. Didn't we talk about that? What? Then Waffle House folks try to go on strike or something. Did they? they? Was, or it's, they was trying to get their wages raised. I don't remember. We yeah, a lot of people I been doing like this we, shit lately. I feel like we talked about that. We might have. Yeah, y'all a didn't lot. get that to work out, did you? Okay. Tell them Russell got the bill. Tell them Russell got it. Goddamn. Tell them Russell got the bill. And don't better not be nobody there when I pull up. Man, I. Right. Everybody was there. 
Everybody, you motherfuckers that don't even work come to work that night for real. You ain't even. Nah, they was outside. Shit. They was outside yeah, taking pictures, but they were there though. It's fucked up. It's the whole entire Waffle House mean parking lot too. <laughs> Keep the people out the parking lot. <laughs> Fuck, we paid yeah, for nah, it. They ain't, in the, they, ain't, they ain't on the Waffle House grass. Oh, okay. They at the gas station next door. Yeah, it's, it's got <laughs> cameras. Zooming. Yeah. <laughs> Sierra! Sierra! Somebody throw a rocket to win that. Man, what? No! <laughs> no! Russell ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> Baby, they throwing rocks. Get in the car. <laughs> Go, go hide in the kitchen. Babes. Man, what? I mean, throw some rocks up. back. Why would we talk about throw some like rocks that? back. They're going to get hit or something. Hey, if he throw... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if he throw a rock right. They're going to get hit or something. I'm going to come out of nowhere. Give me the rock, bitch. Go intercept your heart. <laughs> You're right. A quarterback throw a prison. rock, man. Yeah, all right. If he get it what right. What you in here for? I hit a nigga with a rock. <laughs> <laughs> like a boulder law, like a little rock. A little rock. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> what you mean, like cocaine? Uh, no. I picked that bitch rock. up and threw it across the parking lot to the store over there, twenty-seven yards. He's glad I didn't aim at the gas pump. Yeah, it would. <laughs> I'd have killed everybody over there. That <laughs> bitch just wants a Waffle House. <laughs> See, that's what happened. You don't go to Waffle do House. Take the Waffle House. <laughs> you got to throw rocks at people and shit at Waffle House. This is fucked up. <laughs> Don't do that to Waffle House. You ain't shit. You done been to Waffle House. No, nah, that's what's up. And on top of that, I'm glad that they get to do their internet thing now. I which is shut head. the fuck up. <laughs> nah, no, no, damn. Because that's what happened. They, don't, they ain't talking about this. Like, they ain't talking about these lists. They, they shut didn't. the fuck up. They didn't. Because now look. Now what? Hell. Yeah, now they what? Don't like your black see, love. Yeah, your they don't queen, like to see your a motherfucker doing good that shit. glowed up and got rid of the toxic dude and got the perfect man. Man, yeah, what? He still got all the money. Waffle She's houses. still twerking when she's pregnant. And she, she, and she, he she don't even he took care. Her to Waffle House. He's still throwing yeah, pants. Y'all shutting the fuck up now. Yeah, they don't want to see no good shit. They don't salute no good shit. They that's, just want to see the bad shit. I think that's part shit. of why I really like it because it just made people shut the fuck they up. They did. They nobody <laughs> had nothing to say. And I get it. Like that's what she wants. She pregnant and wants to Waffle House. You get a pregnant barefooted like, at the Waffle I got House. You. We're going to Waffle House. Sierra she, Redneck. She could have been texting him for two and a half weeks straight. This nigga trying to practice. I mean, what? I, I want some Waffle House. Like, right. Like, what are we going to do? She's been craving Waffle House. I just really, I just keep it's thinking about Waffle House. I'm in Arizona, guys. Right. <laughs> we go, okay, talk to me after the kickoff. I'm finna go play the Dolphins in the morning. <laughs> Shit. No Waffle House? Shit about that bitch in Waffle House. Fuck it. I know somebody who won't be throwing rocks at the Waffle House. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> in little pool side. <laughs> yeah, see, that what, that's, that's what Michael said. <laughs> I gotta find it. <laughs> Mike said, in little pool side. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, shit, I, I Mike. You wild as hell for he, this. He, he raps. Right, his his rap name is Tut Tarantino. Tut Tarantino. If you ever Tut listen Tarantino. to some of his raps, I'm like, oh my God. Where does this come from, son? You grew up in a gated community your whole life, but he's rapping my life because we romanticize and fantasize about that old thug life, ghetto life, and all of that stuff. When, 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 we, when we used to work to get away from it, now we've gotten to a place somehow we're running back towards it in the music and everything. I got him. He told him. I don't know how it came about. He was talking on the sports show, nonetheless. Yeah, I, oh. I just played the clip. Yeah, that was in the in, that was in the uh, chat. But you said he called him what now? What you said he called him something? No, he called like, no, he was a hoe or something. No, no, I just said that. No. Oh. That was the vibe he was giving out. <laughs> he called himself a hoe. I'm saying you said I was in it. Oh yeah, nigga. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. But that yeah. would have felt like for real. He that would have felt like. He was like, yeah, no. Well, you, you out here rapping about guns and, and drugs and all this shit. You grew up in the gated community. You ain't do none of this you shit. Know. You grew up rich so you as fuck. about my life. I don't know if he did yeah. none of this shit either. I don't, I don't he might have lived in Maplewoods, but bitch. His son talking about switches. You was practicing football, bitch. <laughs> you tell the truth. You was running routes, God damn it. I don't know. He might be running the mother routes. Yeah, I don't think most of the time it don't work like that. No. 
Not most of the time. I guess it could, but most of the time you do it one or the other. You know that nigga like, nah, bro, go home. You ain't supposed to be out here. You supposed to be catching passes and shit. This this nigga from out here, God like, damn it. I don't know. I never watched no documentary on Michael Irvin. Because if not, you, you yeah. out here. You ain't he definitely finna, was upset. You ain't going to practice. You're talking about this he son. Yeah. But it felt like it felt like old pussy ass nigga for real. <laughs> That's, he said, call out his son on TV. It's wild to me. I don't know well. Like, even the sub beefing for real. I bet it's a Michael Irvin this song coming so. I bet it is. I think he's gonna do, he gonna be like a uh, uh, Brian and Nice Kids now? Fuck it. He gonna go get some more. <laughs> Michael Irvin going away to a new set of kids. <laughs> and name yourself after them. Yeah, name yourself after them, right there. I ain't no more Michael Irvin. Mm-hmm. T- Tarantino Senior. It's wild as hell. What who was this dope boy? What did what did he do with the kids? Um, he he was featured on a song that a nine year old has, uh, from where he's from. Uh, let me see if I can find it. And this nigga like a, a professional rapper. Yeah, I got a song of his on my playlist actually. She is, she is, for real though. If whoever behind that nine year old came with a check, your this, action well, price he, for the he song responded to. Internet saying stuff about it, um, cause he rapped a verse like he always raps. He ain't like do no, yeah, ain't no a, kitty and verse. And the nine year old didn't have no kitty verse either. No, and, well that's different. Yeah, well <laughs> it is, but he responded to it and he was saying like, uh, um, basically that these like I don't know how it is when y'all grow up, but when we grow up, this is regular. Like yeah, all these motherfucker be nine, nine years old out here, guy. Yeah, this is regular, so if I could help this nigga get up through the rap game and he don't got to keep doing this shit he talking about, hey, hell yeah, I hop on the song. What makes sense about? to me. That's all I thought too. I it was like, it seemed like the perfect explanation, a way to to give people some peace of mind and so in, in your own way at least. But and I'm sure it was a check in there. But there still was a nine year old that got us. So yeah. yeah, I guess though, but shit, I could. I don't really. It's business for real. I don't feel like like this a motherfucker condoning a nine year old out here thugging, but see if this nigga out here thugging and he yeah. doing the same shit I'm doing, I mean for real, a nine or eleven year old selling drugs to an older motherfucker, like they gonna still buy that shit. Yeah, I yeah motherfuckers yeah. be be lying ten eleven years old serving fucking zips or whatever the motherfuckers twice two three times they age for real. It's just how I go out here, so shit. Then they got out here to fuck it, yeah. I thought it was interesting. Rap yeah, song, um, get you out yeah, of there, shit. Boy. I liked this album. I just only kept like one or two songs. Oh, yeah. I might have to check cool them out. Album. I ain't never heard of them. Hell. I don't know if you'll like them, but. No, probably not. I think I could probably take your word for that, too. Um, We're going to have to get up out of here soon. We're going hop to hop on this ready. Oh, shit. We ain't, let's talk about facing them real, real quick, because I think this is some good shit for real. Because Rakim. And Scarface. Scarface. Face Both bomb. to be paid $500,000 each for their incredible contribution to the hip hop culture. There's a fund, a charity called Paid in Full. And they in no and on November 17, we are honoring those who have led the culture but have not received the financial rewards that's on par with their cultural contribution. That should get an applause. That is- <laughs> Because they didn't get paid enough for the contributions they made to hip hop. Which, honestly, I don't even gonna sound like an asshole, but that's probably not enough. Yeah, that, nah, I'm, it's, it's something, but yeah, uh, compared to what the fuck there, going on in rap now. If you were to speak yeah, to like the actual contribution and right, just now if being you get, 50 years yeah, old, then compensated for what like, you've done. Yeah. 500 yeah. grand ain't enough for real. But no. I mean, it's a charity, and yeah, ain't gonna tell them what they got and shit. It's a tax write off. Half that's a million is shit. a lot of money. <laughs> Both of them, that's a million dollars here. And it's probably a way to. Never mind. Oh, Good, shit. That's what's up. Oh. Yeah, congratulations, congratulations to them. Congratulations to them. Um, I need to get something. I done made a couple contributions. Shit. Let a nigga get yeah. about $400. Yeah. Send that money. Shit. They said we finna get some stimulus. Send that money. They were finna get like three hundred dollars or some shit. I don't believe nothing about nothing until nah, I see it. Nah, if I don't see the check, they talking yeah, shit. Yeah. And then we got Ki too. That bitch gonna take all our money. 
Yeah. Hey. Put that shit in the Priuses. <laughs> Jesus. We don't talk politics on the Smoker Permitted Podcast. <laughs> me, Ma. They call it me as me, Ma. How the fuck the governor nickname me, Ma? All right. I don't. All right. Um, what am I looking for? Boo. <laughs> yeah. Give me that. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm looking at my watch. It's about that time. Ready, ready, coming This is the part of the show where us, the smokers, the best advice givers to ever give advice to anyone who's needed advice, ever. gives that advice that gives they need that right now. We go on Reddit, we find somebody who needs some advice, we read it. It's why it's called Reddit on Reddit, and we give them the best advice they could ever receive. And y'all are just going to be privileged enough to watch it and enjoy the advice. You You're can welcome. use it in your own situations, too. You're if free you're to. in the situation that they in, maybe it's you that wrote the shit on Reddit. Could be. Reddit on Reddit, ladies and gentlemen. Reddit on Reddit number one. Number one. The title is... So my boyfriend just spent seven hundred dollars in clothes. All right. But made me pay for his transportation, which is six dollars, <laughs> and dinner, which is thirty dollars. No, hey, it might it might have been your turn. <laughs> <laughs> his clothes ain't got nothing to do with you. Shit. <laughs> I feel like she could have just said the dinner and left it at that. I Man, feel like hey, the six dollars. Yeah, she be a penny, goddamn it. <laughs> she be a penny about them six dollars. <laughs> But she might have every right to be. Let's let's see what she. Let's. let's I don't see. know. Seven hundred in club. What did he? What if he just bought one coat? Shit. If he could afford that motherfucker, then hey, seven hundred. Don't ask me. I'm the wrong motherfucker to be asking this question. I could buy a seven hundred dollar coat. Shit. Okay. <laughs> Put a horse on that bitch. Shit. What I colors? Don't get it. I don't even know. We probably multi like it matched the shirt. And shit. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, all right, here we go. Am I the asshole for being upset at this? He literally spent all that money on clothes and had and had money left over. Okay, I thought I was. See, he ain't even broke. He can afford this all shit. Right, I, thought I was messing it up. No, she said he had money left over. All right, but had the nerve to act cheap and couldn't cover the small things. I voluntarily covered breakfast that day and other expenses, which was okay. But am I wrong for feeling like this? Also, while we were shopping, there was a hat that I want, but I would never ask him for it. Gosh, she types weird. Because he he would have said no. I never asked him for anything. So maybe that's why I'm upset he asked me to cover dinner. I don't know. I, have- I just got turned off that he was willing to spend so much on clothes, but couldn't even afford his basic priorities. I feel they're like both twenty six, and they make the same amount. He could have afforded it. Yeah, she knew he could. She said he had money. Yeah, but I, so the last line, she's just taking shots and shit yeah, for she real. Just mad. Yeah, because he could have afforded it. And you keep saying, I don't think the seven hundred dollars on clothes really got shit to do with this conversation. Mm-hmm. That ain't none of your goddamn yeah. business. <laughs> that he ain't spending his money on you. He, he, you he ain't buy the dinner. That's what this conversation is about. He got some money, he ain't pay for dinner. For and real. he ain't buy the hat. And he, he, she ain't even asked for the head, though. Yeah, but she wouldn't because he always said. Because she already, no. she don't even ask, though. She said she never asked for anything because she know he going to say no. She don't know that. Closed mouths don't get fed, goddamn. You should have asked him, especially if he out here, he, he balling, he spending his money on clothes till right now, like, fuck it, yeah. He might have bought that head for real. Mm, she said she never asked him for anything, so why he be asking her for shit? I guess that makes sense too, goddamn. <laughs> that makes sense too, though. If he don't never pay for dinner to shit, bitch, you need not to pay for dinner. You should have went about you something to eat shit. She said she paid for breakfast that day. And breakfast that day. Matter of fact, next time, don't pay for breakfast that day. Don't pay for dinner that day. And buy your motherfucking hat, shit. Yeah. <laughs> shit. And y'all can, you can still ride with him, $6. See what's going to happen. I <laughs> $6 for Don't the do that either, though. She mad about it. He can't make you pay the shit. No. Like, she, yeah, tell him, like, instead of writing, this going to be the best advice I could give. Instead of writing the Reddit about this shit, 
Next time your boyfriend asks you to pay for something, tell him no. Shit. <laughs> no. It's an option. I, that's, I mean, that's the that's best. That's I was thinking. That's that how is. she feel. Like, yeah. Like, I mean, maybe not just be like, no. Be like, look, I feel like you you blow a bunch of money, but then you won't you won't give me shit for real. So I feel like you shouldn't be asking me shit. You spend your money on, on you, I should I'ma just spend my money on me. Yeah. That's that was good for the goose. It's good for the gander. And then they're gonna have a whole argument about who's paying for dinner. Then they don't. You gonna buy your dinner? I'm gonna buy my dinner. Okay. I, if, I mean, this, yeah. it's fucked if up. It works for y'all. Yeah, I don't know how long it's gonna work for <laughs> real because it's gonna be awkward. Like, give me one movie ticket. <laughs> it's gonna be awkward. But we all hugged up on the two. Uh, I, I feel uh, like he maybe he get the point then. Maybe after one or two times of that, he might get the point. The picture. For maybe real. she hasn't gotten the point. No, I, she definitely ain't got the point. <laughs> Maybe that's the point. I think, yeah, no, she know. Like, he, he, I, I think he's made up do. his mind. Yeah, I don't like, care what you I do. ain't giving this bitch no money. He done made up his mind. He not giving you no money for real. And either you going like. to be okay with him not giving you no money and, and splurge it on himself, and you going to sit there and watch the shit and feed him, or cool. you go find a motherfucker who will buy breakfast and then you can buy dinner, maybe. I mean. Yeah, and y'all can both <laughs> but, shop together. Yeah, it don't it don't seem like this to this gonna work for you for real. And I don't think so. No, she didn't say how long they've been together, but they're no. twenty six. Yeah, both of them. and but. for real, if if it's if it's fairly new, the longer you stick around, like it ain't gonna just solve itself. And the longer you stick around and and to see the shit go on, the the more you gonna dislike the motherfucker for real. So yeah, I, if it ain't gonna change, she gonna have a montage in her head of him ringing up. Just, shit how for many times? Dollars. So <laughs> many, man, all right, so many receipts flashing by the screen. He was wearing the new jacket the next man, time he bought a jacket. Right. It was shit, all right, all right. And she gonna be sitting in the corner like this all <laughs> He walking by clean as a bitch. They in the car together. She mad looking out the window. Man, okay. <laughs> he clean as fuck. <laughs> Take a picture on his phone. Man, okay. Tell me she in the background like this, man. <laughs> you guys see nothing but the back of her head in the picture. <laughs> he held one up for her too. The back of her head. He's pouting, goddamn. Man, all right. Back of my bitch head. <laughs> Hungry as hell. This bitch got a slip jam in here. <laughs> <laughs> You got to snap it to it. <laughs> Should have bought you something to eat. Man, okay. <laughs> but yeah, no, I, I will see what he going to do once I will talk to him about it, maybe. Or, or do the other shit and like, yeah, just don't pay for nothing a day or two. See what happens. But don't keep doing that shit. They can't just go like that for real. But yeah, if he ain't going to give you no money, you need a motherfucker who's going to give you some money. Find you a motherfucker who's going to give you some money for yeah. real. It's simple. This world is about money and pussy. As I soon as you look, <laughs> who the fuck? Somebody said it. I heard it. Get it. Man, okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't think this. That girl that sounds congested. I guess it songs. is for people though, but uh, it is. That's what that whole conversation was about. I think I like the money more than the pussy for real. Yeah, she does too. I think she. Yeah. Well, she has one, so it don't really count. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> I think I like the money more than the pussy. two five six seven eight eight. 7339. Call my phone. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Email. Like, us. comment, subscribe. Do this shit too. Um, the little bell. Ding. Click never that bitch. Forget. Oh. Hey, leave a leave a um a review. Whatever yeah. you listen to this podcast. Spotify, on, Google. Leave us a five star review. YouTube. And say something too. Like I don't like whatever the fuck say you want to say. Say boogly. Um say do the FJK. How do you spell oogly boogly? I don't know. <laughs> But yeah, because the fucking reviews do With a lot O's. of shit for the shows, for real. So we, we appreciate some reviews. Lots we don't even want your money. Just leave a review, goddammit. Goddamn it. Yeah, I'm just yeah. Leave a little review. Yeah, that's all we want. Just leave it a review. Uh, yeah. Fuck a iron. Steam your clothes. Absolutely. Um, cinnamon is not sweet. It's not. If she know all the words to Gucci Mane, you know she was riding around with when she was growing up. I you bet she, she got do it. She got eyeball a three point five. <laughs> you know what else she I ain't even talking about weed either. <laughs> I'm talking about hard. She know what uh, she know what eight ball look like. Eyeball it. We appreciate y'all joining us, man. Mm-hmm. That's the gold stuff. Yeah. It's the Reverend. 
I am. I'm Hold Bob. on, I got some. Um, oh, you got some? Smoke a blunt with your mama. That's right. I'm not. Um, I'm not gonna. What else was it? If your favorite drug dealer, you probably get a disability check. He probably gets a disability. I don't know. I'm um, going his word on that. Tell your bitch to quit smiling at me. Stop it. If you feel like they're playing <laughs> with you, air this bitch out. All right. Fuck with us next time, y'all. Fuck with us last time. Yeah. Shit, all right.